Hi guys, it's Rob here and I'm back with another Maya modeling tutorial. In this tutorial I'm going to show you the functionality of the insert edge loop tool. If we go up here to mesh tools, insert edge loop tool, and we click these options here, you're going to note that this options panel opens up. And I'm going to show you how to use two techniques today with the insert edge loop tool. One technique is relative distance from the edge. You'll notice that if I left mouse button click and hold, I now get an edge uh, sort of an icon around my my uh, box, my cube here, that shows where this edge loop would be placed if I were to release the mouse button. You'll also notice that the edge that it's going to drop in, or the edge loop, is perpendicular to the edge that I selected with this tool. So I will drop that edge in as follows. Now in contrast to this, if I hit Control Z, if I want to uh, hit multiple edge loops and set the number of edge loops to 1, now when I click and hold my left mouse button, I cannot move this but it dropped in one perfectly even edge loop. right? But I want to go here and I want to set the number of edge loops to five. Now what this is going to do is whichever edge I select, it's going to drop in five edge loops between the leftmost vertical edge and the rightmost vertical edge. So uh, b between the, the, the here and here basically if I were to select this edge. right? And same on this side. Now if I were to turn it this way, are bounding edges or the bounding edges of the cube so when I insert those five there's they're gonna be much more width I, I now select that it cuts it further uh, by fifths right so now I could just keep using this tool to add more geometry so that's the insert edge loop tool at a glance guys thanks for watching uh, hope you enjoyed please don't forget to like and subscribe and please don't forget to check out my other tutorials thank you